Hello friends, in this video I shall take up an important concept of uh, percentage and this is a concept which is very very often asked in competitive exams and how to find the net percentage increase or decrease in a particular quantity when the quantity first increases by a particular percentage and then decreases by the same percentage. So you need to find the net percentage decrease. Now first thing is there will be net percentage decrease only not increase because it is first increasing by something so the new quantity will be greater on which this decrease of 12 percent will, will be calculated. So the decrease will be greater than the increase. So therefore there is net percentage decrease. Now if you assume the quantity is x and then start working out this question this is going to consume quite a lot of time but through the short trick which I am going to tell you this is going to consume only how much time? Only 5 to 6 seconds time? Yes. Even you can do it without use of pen and paper and uh, just in 5 seconds you can get to the correct option in case of a multiple choice question. Likewise, if the increase and decrease are different then the trick changes but again we have a different short trick for this. You can work out this problem also within 5 to 6 seconds time only. Now why I am taking up these two questions? Because all these short tricks are actually a part of the PDF number 5. All short tricks of percentages are mentioned in this. All short tricks related to percentages. You can, you know, you can calculate all percentages including the decimal percentages and uh, percentages above 100. Whatever percentages questions are there, you can work out orally. So this PDF number 5 is just for you. Uh, my WhatsApp number is here. You can send me a message on WhatsApp if you want this particular PDF. You know, this is one among the 14 PDFs which I have already uh, bought out for competitive exams like SSC, CGL, CHSL and RRB, NTPC, CTET, CATMAT, what not. You know, those uh, kind of uh, uh, exams, you know, you can't just escape these uh, topics of uh, percentage. So let's... Uh, uh, see uh, what is the number on which you have to send me the message 9896369963 you can send me a message on this I will tell you how to procure this particular PDF and even my email ID I uh, will give you for uh, those who are watching from abroad they can send me an uh, email on Dr. Suresh Agarwal D-R-S-U-R-E-S-H Dr. Suresh Agarwal A-W-G-A-R-W-A-L followed by 73 at the rate gmail.com so that's the mail id on which you can send me an email for sending your requirements for for the pdfs very very nominal cost associated with those pdfs but i'm sure these are going to prove uh, like a boon for all competitive exams you know you can increase your speed of calculations by at least 10 times if you practice all these questions through the short tricks i'll show you how see this problem quantity first increases by 12 percent and then decreases by 12 percent so the net percentage decrease in this case can be calculated directly and that is just if you consider this percentage as x so x square upon 100 percent now that is the simplest possible answer of this particular question so if you see x is 12 here so 12 into 12 upon 100 so that will be 144 upon 100 so net percentage decrease will be 1.44 percent no calculations, nothing, no assumption, no variables involved, no solving of long lengthy equations in one variable, no profit and loss formulas and you get to the answer very very easily. Now that is the secret behind you know uh, all the competitive exams. You can crack all those competitive exams only if you are aware of these particular short tricks. Let's see another one. Here we are increasing the quantity by x. So let's assume that this particular value is x 10% uh, and this particular value by which it is decreased is y. So we have two values now x and y. So how do you find the net percentage increase or decrease here? Net percentage increase or decrease. If you get your answer as positive it will be increase. If you are get your answer as negative it will be decrease. Now what is the formula for this? Just write it as x that is 10 minus y that is 5 and then subtract the product of x and y 10 and 5 up divided by 100 from this. So this will be the simplest possible answer of this particular question. So this is 5 minus 
This is 50 upon 100, which is half, so 0 0.5. So 4.5 percent. Uh, wh uh, what is this? Increase or decrease? We have got the answer in positive here. So this has to be 4.5 percent increase. You have seen in the question before, if the quantity remains same, first increase, then decrease, then there is always decrease. But in case of difference in the increase and decrease, you have to consider the sign of this particular answer. So x minus y minus xy upon 100, that is going to give me the correct answer in a matter of just 5 to 6 seconds. So friends, these are the tricks you need to master very, very quickly. And once again, I should tell you that these are the PDFs which are going to help you out in succeeding in competitions. You know, hundreds of students have uh, cleared government exams after studying from all those PDFs which I keep on providing you on the channel. So just send me a message on the WhatsApp number here 9896369963 or email me on drsureshagrawal73 at gmail.com. I shall surely come up with the response uh, to your messages and you will find them very, very useful for developing your speed of calculation, you know, at least 10 times. So friends, if